In this video, we're going to try to clear up a few things about converting your stock HID headlights to LED bulbs. We often get the question, can I replace my HIDs with LEDs? The easy answer is yes, but there are a few things you'll need to consider before purchasing the new LED bulbs. There are two options you have. One is our plug and play CS7035 HID replacement bulb. The other option is to buy one of our LED bulbs that will fit your D1, D2, D3, or D4 HID bulb that will work independently without a ballast. Either one of these options will work to replace your HID if your HID ballast is working correctly. The HID ballast works to convert 12 volts coming from your car into hundreds or even thousands of volts to power the HID bulb. If your HID ballast is working properly, but the bulbs are burnt out, or you just want LED bulbs, the CS7035 will be a great option. This is a plug and play bulb. It requires no modifications or rewiring. To install the plug and play bulb, you will need to remove the HID bulb from the housing and unplug the wire connector. The LED is an exact match for the HID with the same chuck, the same plug, and the HID igniter is the same size as the LED fan. So you'll just need to plug the wire connector into the LED and install the LED into the housing. For this Mercedes, there's a bulb holder adapter, but not all installations will include this. And just like any LED bulb, be sure that the LED chips are facing out to the 9 o'clock and 3 o'clock position. The D2 and D4 CS7035 have a double rubber ring adjustment. The double rubber ring allows you to adjust the bulb in the chuck, and you can also remove the chuck for easy installation. If your HID bulb is working, but your ballast is out, you can still use LED replacement bulbs, but the plug and play CS7035 won't work. To test your ballast, swap the working HID bulb with the bulb that doesn't work. If the bulb lights after you've switched it, then the bulb is the problem. If the working HID bulb still doesn't light after you've swapped out the bulb, then it's likely the ballast is out. You can avoid replacing your ballast by bypassing it and installing LED bulbs. This installation is a bit more complicated than the plug and play, but we'll take you through the steps. The most important thing about this installation is you'll be splicing into the 12 volt wire that powers the ballast and not the wire that comes from the ballast to the bulb. We'll be showing the steps on this 2007 Toyota Prius. The installation on your vehicle may be slightly different, but this will highlight the steps you need to take. Locate the HID ballast. To identify the ballast, most ballasts have this electrical warning on them. Determine which is the 12 volt input and the HID output. The HID output will go directly to the HID bulb. The 12 volt input comes from outside into the light housing assembly. The 12 volt power input for this Prius is attached to the dust cover. Remove the HID bulb from the housing. Begin by cutting back some of the wire insulation to expose the two wires. We recommend using these T-taps, which allow you to splice into the wires without any cutting. Install the open side of the T-tap onto one of the wires, and the other T-tap onto the other wire. In most cases, the red wire is positive and the gray or black wire is the ground. In this case, the LED bulb is not polarity sensitive, so you can splice the LED into either wire. Insert the LED wire into the end of the T-tap. Squeeze the metal tab with pliers and close the cap.
Insert the other LED wire into the other T-tap. Squeeze the metal tab and close the cap. We recommend using some electrical tape to secure the connection. The LED bulb is now wired into the 12 volt power, bypassing the ballast. Unlike the Mercedes we covered earlier, this bulb is installed without an adapter holder. However, for this installation, the spring holder won't fit over the bulb. You can remove the chuck from the bulb and install it first. Lock it with the spring and install the bulb into the chuck. Be sure the LED chips are orientated to the 3 o'clock and 9 o'clock position by pushing and turning the bulb in the chuck if needed. To finish the install, we also recommend taping up the HID connection. You can tuck the unused HID wire into the housing along with the LED wires and driver. Either of these LED replacements are options, but it depends on your needs to decide which bulb will work best for you. We have full-time customer support and we print our phone number and email on every box if you're still unsure which will work for your car. Safer, smarter, brighter, better. We are Ala Lighting.